Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art and let's draw the awesome looking drift skin in Fortnite. So let's get started with a quick sketch and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this and to begin we're going to start out with his eyes. So we're just going to draw almost like two brackets. We're going to draw one line across. And then on the end here, on the corner, just kind of slant down. I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to draw a line across. And then slant down on the corners. Okay, and then once you have that, we can draw in the eyeball. So right underneath the line, let's draw like a little semicircle. Okay, and then I'm going to shade it in. I'm going to leave a little bit of highlight. Just to make it look a little bit more lively. Okay, and then from here I'm going to draw his eyebrows, so just straight up. So this one's easy, just come up above the eye. Just draw one line across. Slightly slanting up. And I'm going to try to try and make it a little bit thicker here. It's kind of small. So just make it a little bit thicker and it's just kind of slant down on the corners. And then on this side, he's going to have a little, kind of like a band-aid here. So I'm just going to draw a little rectangle. Okay, so that's going to be his eye. So let's draw in the uh, side of the face. So just on the side here, it's almost going to be pretty straight. Just kind of come down. And now we can draw in the mask. So in the middle, you can make a little dot. And then we're just going to draw a slant. Okay, so slanting down to the sides. And then now we're going to continue on with the mask. So we're going to continue this line. And it's going to be coming in slightly. And now here we're gonna go up to the, I mean go down to the middle for the chin. Okay, and then once we have this, we can add in some details. So this one's easy, it's gonna be in the middle. We're just gonna add a little bar here. And it's gonna have some uh, hooks right here. So we're just gonna draw just little slanted rectangles. Okay, so that's pretty much his, uh, his mask and face. So let's finish up the head. So we're just going to go up slightly. So now we're going to curve it in slightly. And then for his hairline, you can come down and just in the middle, just make a, a dot. And then we're just going to go out. So there's going to be a slight angle to it. And then for his hair, it's just going to be pretty cool. So we're going to go up on the sides. And then you can go up from the middle, you can just kind of make up a little point first. And then we'll slant down. And then for this one, it's going to come down and then go out and finish that off. And then there's going to be one more spike here. So just draw one more spike right behind and then add in some detail here. So we're going to start on the top. Okay, just this slant slant, just kind of contouring the, uh, the hair just to give it some flow to it and then here we're gonna draw one more going up this side and we can actually draw a couple more just going up okay and to finish off his face let's we gotta draw his ear so around the eye here let's draw one little curve so come out to the side all right so let's move on to the body and for his neck we're just gonna come out slightly here on his jaw just come just come out very little then we're just gonna go straight down for his collar. Okay, and then once we have that, we're just gonna draw one curve around. That's gonna be his collar. All right, and then we're gonna draw his shoulders. So on the corner here, we're just gonna go out. He's got pretty wide shoulders. And then now we're just gonna pinch it in all the way down to his waist. And just kind of straighten it out a little bit on the end here. This shirt kind of overhangs. Okay, and then we're gonna come in to finish off his shirt, just kind of slant down toward the middle. And let's add in some detail. And right here in the collar, we're just gonna draw two lines like this. And then we're gonna continue that two line. Just come into the body more and close it off. And then in the middle, there's gonna be a zipper. So we're gonna draw another two lines and continue that and just kind of end it right around there and just close it off. So that's going to be, and if we wanted to, we can add in a little bit detail for the zipper. 
Okay, and then from for some uh, more details here, just come from here and go all the way to the corner. So here, let's go all the way to the corner, the shoulder. And then one more line on his shirt. So we just gonna come from here, let's go all the way up. And then lastly, he's got a little bit of triangle here. So these are just designs on his shirt. And if you want to, there's gonna be one little rectangle here too as well. Okay, so his shirt is really easy. So let's move on to his arm. So we're gonna come down and here's your armpit. And then for his shoulder, I'm gonna come out. For his bicep here, we're just gonna draw a bracket. And then we're gonna start up here, another bracket. So here's his elbow. And then lower arm, we're just gonna come out. Come out, come back in, and then he's got a wristband. So we're just gonna close that off. And we're gonna extend it slightly. Let's draw like a little, almost like a box. It's gonna be his wristband and for the details, we can add in a little arc like that. And then for his uh, fist, so we're gonna come in, go out, just kind of hook it in a little bit. And then here's the back of the fist. Let's come down. And his other fingers is gonna curl in. And he's got those gloves, so we're gonna have to draw in just draw a little rectangle there. And it's gonna have has a little padding here on the, on the back, so I'm just gonna draw a little rectangle there. Alright, so let's draw out the other arm. So I'm gonna come across here. Here's the armpit. Here's the shoulder coming down. Extend it slightly, and then I'm just gonna draw his bicep. Start up here. Okay, lower arm. Slight angle. Out, straight down. Okay, close it off and then again extend it slightly. Almost like a box and then again the same detail here. And for his fist, come down, just kind of hook it. Back of the fist. And then we just kind of curve this. And then here for the glove detail. And then again the back of the glove, just one little rectangle there. Alright, so very simple arms. So now let's move down to his uh, pants. So his pants are a little bit different. Um, come down in the center here, and let's draw one line across going this way. And then the center here, we're gonna come down this way. So I'm just drawing some folds for, the, for his pants. So now we're gonna start on this side here. So we're gonna continue this curve here, just gonna come down. Okay, just kind of hook it out slightly and then come in. It's gonna be uh, his knee. So we're gonna start here in the middle, come out slightly, come down, again hook it out a little bit and then come back in for his knee. Okay, and then for the, his lower leg, so we're just gonna draw, we're just gonna come out and then come back in, and then we're just gonna close it for now with a slight slant. So let's work on the other side first. Okay, so we're gonna come down here, follow the line, slight curve, in here, Come down to flare it out slightly and come back in. So use the other side for reference so you know how far down to go. And then now for the lower legs again, come out, pinch in, and then we're just gonna close it off. Okay, and then it's got some really cool pockets, so we can draw them now. So right here, just slant. And then this part is gonna slant down this way. And then just go back out. Okay, so this side as well, slant down. And then we're gonna slant out this way. And go back out. And then the flaps here, we're just adding some details. And then there's some some kind of logo here. Some kind of label. Okay, so that's his pants, and let's finish off his shoes. He's got these uh, big high tops. So on the corner here, just gonna come out. And we're gonna pinch it in. Just kind of close it off with a slight curve. And now we're drawing the dome shape. So we're gonna come down here. And this side is gonna go out more. And then we're gonna close it. And since I went down quite a bit, so I'm just gonna draw his sole right here. 
details is pretty easy. It's just going to be one arc from here, side to side. And then there's going to be a little bit mark here. So come down and just kind of round it off. Okay, so let's, so let's draw the other side. It's going to be the same thing. Slant out, come back in, close it with a curve. Now we're going to come down, use the other side for reference. Come out more on this side, come down, close it, and then again, a little bit so. And then from here, we're going to go side to side from the corner. Let's draw an arc. And then now two lines here, and let's close it off with a curve. And that is it for this very cool looking drift skin in Fortnite. So hope you guys like the way it turned out. And if you do, please do give me a thumbs up and I will see you next time.